to be camera footage. The only thing I admit to is May 8th, 2019 Hold when on, I went to did, Jason's house. That's like the only drive, thing. You did drive your car through Jason's house. That's what he's just talking right? about with like the brick through the wood thing. I admit to that. That part I admit. But did you say that I was violent towards David or anything like that? Like, and I admit to it. Like, Dude, I you mean, drove your car through Jason's house? Not like through it, but I was definitely like, I honestly was so high. I like literally don't remember. Like I just remember, I guess apparently I threw a brick through it, which is totally, I totally believe. I don't you know. You drove your car? I believe you threw I was a brick high through the window. That. I was just like so fucked up. I was so fucked up. It was so embarrassing. And I admit, if, if Jason wants to sue me for that, I like sue no me for that. It. Okay, that I admit. Hi. Oh my gosh. Thank you guys for coming to my 31st birthday. Hey. Friend. So if you're here, you're a friend, and I really appreciate no. it. When you did my videos, when I had my, that day you posted it was my birthday, and when I ended up in, like, the hospital for a meth overdose, so that was when, so I can't, I literally was coming down straight from the hospital, like, blood all over my face, like, wiped off, and I saw the video, and I was like, I'm responding right now, so. Hey, guys, what is up? It is, uh, freaking six in the morning. I really didn't get a lot of sleep last night, or the night before, or the night before. Um... Fair warning, I've been kind of going through it. <laughs> I've been kind of going through it and, um, you know, I'm trying to contain and reel in my emotions and not just blurt them out online. This is a response video to a video that H3H3 put out yesterday. And like, I just, I just watched it now and it like really made me like, not only like really sad and upset, it just made me so sad and upset that like there's this 40 year old man shaming like girls. Hey guys, so I am officially 31 years old. I have celebrated my birthday. Um, I am so thankful for everyone who came to my birthday last night. Um, I have been just having such a hard time lately. Did you say this year? Yeah. Wow. My birthday party. After. Remember my birthday party? Oh! Wow. That's the tea. Oh, oh my God. I got so much tea. Shit. Can we get Jason as a guest on this podcast? Because the tea at my birthday party is this. Jason blocked me that night. I remember that. Yeah. And it was, and I was, I was on meth. And there was some tea to that whole story. But I feel like I should only say it if you here. It's crazy for me. Like, I had no, no idea. Mm -hmm. I thought you were in, in perfect health and, mm -hmm. and in great mood. Yeah. No. Huh. It definitely was. It was weird. I, I I got tricked. I talked about this a little bit on like my podcast that no one listened to. So this one maybe some people listen to. And I got I got tricked. I thought it was coke, and it was definitely not coke. It was like rocks up my nose. Have you ever tried it? No, yeah. never. Oh, I, I, I don't know. I thought it was coke. It felt like coke. I yeah. felt like I didn't. You know, meth sounds so hard. Like when someone says they're on they're on meth or they have a meth face, you yeah. think oh they're so hard and whatever. But it just seemed like coke to me. I don't know. Can we talk about this? I don't know. I ended up in the hospital. Like. And I was, not only was I in, ended up at the hospital, I remember my group of people I was with literally kicked me out the, the car and may, had me walk in by myself on meth. There's so much more to the story. <laughs> you hit everyone. What was going on there? Oh, I was addicted to meth earlier this year. Shut up. Wow. I have never you... tried meth before and I tried it this year on accident and then like I was. Have you said this publicly? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I was 5150, I went to a mental hospital, then I tried meth after that, and then on my birthday, I, like, got into, like, a meth accident, and then that was it. I mean, I wasn't, like, addicted to meth, but I kind of was, like, without knowing. I thought it was coke. I really did. I thought it was, like, like rock coke. I thought it was, like, like really just hard coke. And I didn't know the difference until I was, like, oh, that was meth when I went to, like, the hospital. I was, like, oh. How do you accidentally do meth thinking it's coke? Because, obviously, you smoke meth. No, I More snorted it. Oh, you did? Yeah. Interesting. And it was like in lines. Like it, I thought it was actual coke. It was like in lines, like cocaine. Who the fuck gave you meth instead of coke? Was it fucking Dobrik? <laughs> <laughs> Just uh, somebody. That's not but how, uh, meth. That's a hard one to kick. How'd you get off? Well, I wasn't like super. Okay, here's the thing. Okay, here's the thing. I, I say like addicted as like a joke. I wasn't actually super addicted. I probably only did it like five times. The problem is I abused it every time to the point of where I was like literally like compulsing. You know what I mean? Like I was like this. You know what I mean? So like. May 6th today, May 6th, something kind of lisp when I said that, and um, yeah, I'm like two days out from being 31. Hey, if you're squeamish, that's your warning. I literally massacred my face. Oh my god, you know how I said I was going to leave that one alone? It was multiples. Oh my god, it was I'm being crazy. I just look like I'm literally on meth right now. Went on the same medication. 
and I wonder if that's also kind of causing this outbreak. The whole crashing the car thing, that may not have never happened. It was a story that was started and I was so messed up that night that I don't even know what happened. And I still haven't got any answers about that. So that story could be completely made up. I don't know. And I don't really like even talking about it because I don't get answers from it. And the person who started that needs to clarify that because I don't even think that happened. I hope. No, I, I, I know you guys had a nasty breakup. You drove your car into his house and stuff like that. So you drove your car into his house and stuff like that. So you drove your car into his house and stuff like that. So the whole crashing the car thing, that may not have never happened. You drove your car into his house. So that story could be completely made up. I don't know. You drove your car into his house and stuff like that. So